In January 2015, the 114th Congress will take office. However, not all public officials will be returning. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Robert Trainum, and I'm joined by Congressman Rush Holt, Democrat from New Jersey, who has served 16 years in the Congress. Well, Congressman, 16 years in the Congress, that's a long, long time. Why are you uh, leaving? Well, it's, it's been a good run. Um, I, I, I guess I call it the Ecclesiastes principle. There's a time for everything, right? And uh, it seems uh, it's time to go. So this you was know, your no decision? One, no one, it, very much my decision, and for all positive reasons. Uh, some people think that it's, you know, uh, out of frustration and the situation in Washington. No, it's for all positive reasons. Uh, it's good for the system. Uh, no one should expect their representative to be around forever. Um, and I think it's time for me to do some other things. I'm not using the word retire. Uh, I'm, uh, a new chapter. <laughs> new chapter is fine. We can put it that way. Um, and it's, it, it has been a good run. I, know, it's been very satisfying. It really has been. I've done a lot of different things in my life. Um, but uh, this is one job where at the end of every day, just about, I had the sense of having helped somebody. And that's a pretty good job to have. That's actually a very good feeling to, to have, yeah. Congressman. You, what's interesting is um, you mentioned that um, you're not leaving for partisan reasons. And the reason why I find that interesting is because when you take a look at the polls, more and Amer more Americans are fed up with the political system the way they see it. They feel as though it's that partisanship is at record levels. They feel as though it's that things are not getting done in Washington, D.C. Uh, your colleagues in the House, your colleagues in the Senate have said, many of them have said, that this is the most partisan atmosphere they've ever witnessed. But yeah, that's, I'm not, I'm not fed that up with it. And, and as far as getting things done, you know, I look back over 16 years, you know, I, um, I rescued uh, the Land and Water Conservation Fund and, and uh, accomplished some other things on the environment. I created the Teach Acts, uh, the Teach Act, which gives uh, prospective teachers um, direct grants as undergraduates to, pre to prepare to teach uh, math, science, and foreign languages. Got $22 billion of new money for science research. Um, so, you know, I, I felt I could, I, I, I have a record a of having accomplished some things. Um, you've got more than $100 million of new funding for suicide prevention in uh, the military and in the Veterans Administration. So I feel good about what I've done, and mostly I feel good about having worked hard in central New Jersey to help people understand that we can have a government of, by, and for the people. Congressman, you work in a system where it's all about seniority. It's all about moving up the ladder because the more seniority you have, the more powerful you become, mm -hmm. which thus in the process, one can make the argument translates into power for your constituents. Are you leaving at the top of your career and thus in the process, is that a detriment to your constituents back well, home? Well, I'd like to think I'm leaving at the top. That's always <laughs> a good feeling. Sure. Um, I don't think I'm uh, leaving the constituents in the lurch at all. Uh, I... Uh, see a very good successor uh, coming along, someone experienced. I can say she, because both candidates are women. <laughs> and, uh, Which is a good thing uh, in terms of representation. <laughs> yes. And so uh, uh, I, I think uh, uh, everyone can be better off in this. And it, it, it was time for me, uh, and I uh, look forward to what I'll do next, whatever that might be. We have 25 seconds left, yeah. Congressman. Um, yeah. Are you going to miss the power and the prestige of being a member of Congress? Will no. you miss that? No, no, no. I mean, certainly, you know, I, I've gotten to do some marvelous things, uh, you know, visiting national parks and getting a red carpet treatment and that sort of thing, meeting some really fine people. But I'll keep in touch with these fine All people right. in New Jersey. There you have it. Congressman Rush yeah. thank you very much for joining us. Best thank of you. luck to you. And thank you for joining us for this edition of Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Robert Trainum. Have a great day. Bye-bye.